Hi everyone, and this is a quick video on how to calculate the Vegas bottle service here. Most of you probably don't understand how the bottle service works, so this is a great video for you to, to see how what you're being charged for and to, to budget better for your bottle service. Now, so just a few things to go over. Uh, the minimum is the amount you have to spend for the table. For instance, you have about six to eight people, usually that would be a thousand dollar minimum in most of the clubs here. So you have to spend about a thousand dollars to have that table. So you can spend that on bottles, on drinks, or anything else. So that doesn't include anything else yet. So that doesn't include the, the 8.1 sales tax and the gratuity is usually 20% and they add that on to the, the final bill. Entertainment tax is usually charged when there's a special event or a big DJ or a special performance. So be careful. Make sure, make sure when you it looks like there's someone performing or it says live performance by, or if it's a really big DJ, then there's usually another 10% added on to that to the bill. Service fees are usually what's being charged to you to take care of hosts, to take care of bussers and security. So if you're working with a lot of hosts that are handling that for you or handling the whole table for you they'll add on an additional service fee for that. Handshakes and table fees. So most of the time on a busy on a busy night, you might you might have a host tell you that it's going to be a a $1000 minimum plus a $200 handshake or a $200 table fee. That table fee guarantees that your table won't get bumped. So for instance, if someone else was willing to pay more for that specific table, if you guarantee that you're going to pay for that table fee, then you're not going to get bumped, you know, until you, until you get there. But you still have to get there early for most of the, if it's a busy night. Um, the handshakes also guarantees certain specific at uh, certain um, tables or certain locations. So if you wanted an inside table, they'll say okay, it's going to be an additional three or five hundred handshake or table fee. So these are things that your hosts are probably going to mention. But just just so you know what you're paying for. You're paying to guarantee a location or to guarantee that your table won't get bumped. Now, this is just a quick sample quote for about nine people. It's For most of the clubs, the minimum would be about $1,500 for nine people. It might be a little bit more for the bigger clubs, for the newer clubs, but this is the, this would be a regular quote for that. This is not, this is including the tax, the gratuity, which is a 20%, and I put a, a handshake just in case. For instance, it's, it's kind of like a semi-busy night. You want it to guarantee a specific table, do a $100 handshake. And then I added the service fee just to take care of the tips for your host, for your security buster. Like what I said, that service fee could be anywhere from 5 to 10%. So total for a $1,500 beverage minimum, minimum spend, with tax, tip, and all fees would be $2,096.50. Now, if you're working with uh, an independent host that want, that takes care of your table, that pre-checks pre in your table for you and everything, and you pay with a credit card, there might be an additional 3% for, for, for the credit card fees. So you might be able to work out something where you pay through PayPal or you pay through Venmo or pay cash that night uh, to the host so that you don't pay that 3%. So for, for a $5,000 table, that 3% would, would be a lot. But usually, it's really convenient to have a host check in your table for you in case you guys are running late. Now, this is a sample quote for things with LET, which is the entertainment tax, like I mentioned. So if you have a special performance that night, they're going to add in that 10% for the LET tax. So instead of two thousand ninety six, you're going to be paying twenty two forty six fifty for a night with a special entertainment or LET tax. So that's an additional seven hundred dollars on top of your on top of your minimum. Now a lot of people are wondering, okay, so if I'm I'm doing a beverage minimum. How many how many bottles will I really get? For most of the clubs. The bottles usually start anywhere from five hundred to six fifty. There are a couple clubs where it it starts at six fifty. So even if 
so if you have a 1500 minimum that's only two bottles and a few drinks but if you go to a club where bottles start around 450 or 500 then that gives you three bottles the premium bottles, you know, for Great Goose or any premium bottles, it'll start higher, which is about six fifty or more. So for a fifteen hundred minimum, you probably get about two premium bottles for that, along with some mixers and everything. Now there are some clubs that do offer packages for industry, so this is perfect when you have a host that can that can work this deal out for you. And usually they only offer it to industry because they're the ones that bring in a lot of clients. So if, you have, if you're working with a specific host already, ask them if they can get you any packages or any deals anywhere. And you will really save probably anywhere from two to $300 for two bottles, which is huge as opposed to trying to spend full price. So for tables, um, all that in, this is all that's included for the table. Entry through the table line, unless you're getting hosted. Uh, cover for everyone at the club. So if you have the nine people for that $1,500 minimum, you don't have to pay extra on the cover. Mixers like juices, soda water, and of course Red Bull and bottled water, you'd have to pay extra for those. Uh, this table is usually yours for most of the night. But just be careful not to finish your bottle too soon or sometimes they'll try and get you to buy more bottles or they might just sell that table right away if you finish it too soon. You do have a security that watches over that table if you need to. But if you guys want to pay, you know, tip them extra to make sure that you're taken care of, you can do that too. Um, for some companies that, like what I mentioned earlier about the independent host, they offer the hosted entry. So what this means is they make sure that you get in much quicker and make sh they make sure that your table is prepaid and pre-checked in before you get there. Because normally it takes about 30 minutes to try and get in, wait for your server, pay for your table, get your bottles. It takes, it's, it's a bit of a process. But what these companies do is they do all that for you before you get there. So all you have to do once you get there is just open the bottles and then get ready and party. So this might be a good service or this might be something that you might want to ask your host if they offer. And that's it's really, it's really great for convenience. So that concludes the, our video on the math for table service. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Um, if you guys want to book your tables, book it through your host now and get your quotes and ask some questions if you need to. And if you don't have a host yet, feel free to contact us at tables at teamkaizen, team-kaizen.com, or you can text me at 702-514-0818. Thank you and have a great day.